I'm now here in a balcony of a two-bedroom unit on the sixth floor of Cochin Building here in Mulberry Place. And this is the view from the unit. So I'm now here in the balcony. Okay. So here, this is what I can see. Very nice view. I'm in Cochin Building. And this is one of the four buildings that's turned, o turned over by the MCI. And a phase two will be launched soon. And it will be on that area, beginning on that. That's another one building. And there's more buildings on this side. Okay. So after this vacant lot is Save More. It's the Akasha town center you see that those buildings are from another community which is ivory wood that area is birchwood okay so here this is Benjamin building and when you do the rotunda there turn left that's the main gate okay. so we're opposite the building we're in the admin office is on the basement 2 of Benjolin building so this is Benjolin and this is Cochin okay. the houses that you see on that side is Mahogany Place 2 and Mahogany Place 3 and M residences. Okay. So this is a newly turned over unit. As you can see, you can put here um, window type aircon with a maximum size of maybe one HP. And you have here a balcony door. So it has a glass door and a screen door. So you can open either. And then on this side, you have the windows. It's the same. You have a glass window and a screen window. Okay. So coming from the balcony, this is the master's bedroom. Okay. So you have plugs for telephone. Okay. And then you have for cable and other outlets. Okay. So from this side, you can put a, an aircon here. It can be a condensed 0.75 or 1 HP. Okay. And this is the basic light that they put. It's around 6 to 9 watts of um, yellow light. Okay. The doors also have the uh, door stopper. Okay. You also have sprinkler and fire alarm. Okay. So let's check the second bedroom. For the second bedroom. So here's the second bedroom.
in this area you can put your um, floor to ceiling cabinet or you can place here a single bed double deck okay then that's for the aircon you also have for the windows okay here as you can see it's empty now if you push this to the right that is automatically locked see and you if you want to open just press it but it's hard to lock from the outside it's really locked and you can also use the screen window if you want some air okay or if you want you can climb here <laughs> to go to the balcony okay so this is the second bedroom Again, there's a door stopper so that when you push this door, this knob does not reach the wall. Let me close this. And this one too. So you have the two doors here. Okay? So. This is the living area. Again, you have different outlets. And here you have for the cable, telephone line. That's for the cable, the telephone line. And then for the internet. Okay. Okay. So when I am in this corner, so this is how it looks like. Again, you have a smoke alarm or fire alarm. Then you have a sprinkler over there. Okay. And then on that side, you can install a split type aircon so let's check the kitchen okay on this side is where your refrigerator will go so the maximum height for the refrigerator is about five feet tall okay and then on the other side here is where your stove will go and then you have this okay it will be best if you put a frosty sticker on these two windows and if there's uh, if you're cooking you can open that okay So now let's check the different cabinets. Mm -hmm. So many cabinets for your stuff for your kitchen you So check. This is 
how it looks like. Okay. Let me close them first. Here again is your kitchen. Then we now go to the bathroom. Oh, by the way, this is the main switch for the electricity. Okay, and then you can see here the meter center or the sizes, electric sizes or watts. Okay, now we have the bathroom. It's still sealed. Like a flash. It's a big. Bathroom. So this is for the soap and uh, shampoo and whatever. Then you have a rain shower. Then you can put your water heater over there. So, again. You can also put a bidet over here. Okay. So, again, this is how it looks like. It would be recommended to put a full size um, on this side, a full size mirror. It's nice. And then over here, you can also put a hanging towel rack. Okay. Or also on this side. Okay. Then. You may also put something here. Okay. But then make sure that when you close this, it will not reach the wall. So that you can open this door without hassle. Otherwise, the clip here will be banging this side of the wall. Okay. Um, we also have this. This will be wired so that you can use it to have your hair, uh, how do you call it, for your hair, and also um, say to charge your cell phone. Okay. Then over here is the wash area. You can put your washing machine here. That's gonna be the drain, and there's the that's for the faucet, and that's for the plug. Okay. So again, this is how it looks like. There's your two bedroom. Okay. Now we're gonna check. How it looks like outside the unit before we go outside let's check how it looks like from the inside of the unit okay. let's go out let's go let's go let's go okay. this is the hallway you have one elevator per building and you have Two stairs, one for both sides. Okay. This is open. It's locked. That's where you have your um, it's for plumbing. Okay. This is the unit that we saw. Okay. 
so let's go up let's check the deck So remember the, the unit is on the left side so the laundry area will be on the left side also when you go to the deck so this is how it looks like okay. super brand new Okay, let's check 615 so there is a number that's indicated on top just like that okay so here is how the deck looks like inside okay so here you can store your stuff or pang hang ng clothes as you can see the ceiling has two parts this one is much of um, lighter so when it uh, it's hot or it rains you can hear the water or you, if it's it's sunny it's super sunny naman for this one it's a, a darker area so that when you are doing your laundry here it's not gonna be too hot okay and then you can have your electricity and your water installed so let's go to another deck that has an installed one so you can see how it looks like okay so this is a is another from another deck we're in they have already installed the water okay so you have maybe this is a tandem so you have the water meter then there's the faucet and another faucet there then you have the electric meter over here and then you have a breaker saksakan then to turn on if you want to have your own light yeah this is nice i don't know but this is part of okay so that's a nice example okay. again this is how it looks like one two three Now let's go down. Okay. We'll just wait for the elevator. So we're here in Cochin building. This is a scenic elevator.
This is the ground floor. Look in it. Okay, and the ground floor has this area. Again, here is the ground floor. Okay, so let's go outside. When you get out, this path goes to level 1 of Bengaline. Then you go to level 2 for the admin office. So we're here outside Cochin. So just to show you how it looks like. There's the clubhouse. Okay. We are now near the rotonda. turn this is how it looks like this is Bang Jalin building that's Pochin that's Dewey and the last one is Marceline over there so so when you get out of the gate and you turn right that's going to Akasha S to the Akasha Estates town center which is just over here over there and that's Cedar Crest that's M Residences. Okay. The unit that we checked earlier is over there. That building. Okay. That building and then to that side. Because it's facing this building. There's more buildings to come. Let's go around. Okay, so that's Cochin, Bengalin, and the first pool, and then there's the clubhouse. Okay, that's Marceline, Dewey, Cochin. Bengalin. Okay, so let's go to the clubhouse. Let's check. Guys, there's a second phase to launch for this phase. The building will be in front of Marceline, that area that is covered with a blue wall. Okay. 
and then the next buildings are behind the clubhouse So let's check what we have here. have a lounge area on the second floor uh, entertainment room downstairs a gym convenience store water station and a laundry station okay let's check it out we're now in the basement so you have a shower area for girls and boys you have the uh, this is nice so they covered it up okay you have the laundry station here but still not open okay then you have the water station it's already open so you have three 40 gallons of water every month you have the fitness gym we're now inside the gym not bad But the use of the gym is a separate fee, monthly. I think it's around a thousand peso or yeah, something like that. Okay. Yeah, there is an aircon inside. Okay, let's get out. That's the fee for the gym. It's two five per month or for you per year I mean. Or daily fifty pesos or monthly five hundred. Okay. And this is where the convenience store will be set up. So let's go up. We are gonna go up using the this other area where they usually pull their water. Okay. So see that's Marceline. Then you have another pool over here. Okay. So again, those behind the blue fence is for the new buildings. Then you have the shower area here. Nice. Okay. What a tour! So again, that's Marceline. 
So all the buildings here have six floors. Okay. I have you I hope you have enjoyed the tour. Again, that's Marceline, Dewey, Cochin, Benjamin, and the clubhouse. I wanna swim, I wanna swim, I wanna swim. This is just four feet deep. Bye guys. Oh, it's not yet goodbye, sorry. We have to check the parking. Let's go to Cochin. This is the parking ramp to Cochin. go down okay over to that side is the Meralco meter for all the units of this building and we have here level one okay so this is level one You have stairs on both sides and an elevator. Then if we go down, there's level 2 of parking. Okay. So that's how it looks like. That's for the other, the next building. And then you have um, underneath the stairs is the really nice mailbox. Okay. As you can see, you also have CCTV camera. This is really the end of the video. Bye-bye. See you on the next one.